this is Madeline Golick, pelvic health physiotherapist here at Ecophysiotherapy, and welcome back to our final video of our pregnancy series. I am here with the lovely Dr. Emily Lipinski, our naturopathic doctor, and for today's topic we are talking about key concepts in nutrition, specifically centered around um, healthy weight gain during pregnancy. Of course, this is for educational purposes only and should not be taken as sound medical advice, but uh, let us learn a little bit more about uh, nutrition. So, I guess the first question most women want to know is, what is a healthy amount of weight gain during pregnancy? Exactly. It's a question I get often, and it really depends on your weight uh, prior to becoming pregnant. So if you're underweight, um, guidelines show that gaining at least 37 pounds is ideal uh, for underweight women. If you're normal weight, so that, no, and I'm talking about weight being based on your BMI, your body mass index, which you can always talk to your doctor about having that measured so you know where you are. But a normal weight um, individual would want to gain somewhere between 30 to 37 pounds. And if a woman's overweight or obese but at the time that she becomes pregnant, um, she actually doesn't want to gain too much more weight during pregnancy. Uh, anything over 25 pounds is not advised. And this is because being overweight during pregnancy or obese can increase the chance of gestational diabetes and poor birth outcomes. Of course. Um, so I guess the other question probably women want to know is how to maintain a healthy weight uh, through nutrition uh, throughout their pregnancy. Right, so maintaining proper nutrition and also having um, exercise and still moving while pregnant is important, but specifically with nutrition, um, you want to make sure that if you're normal weight uh, upon becoming pregnant that you're getting around 2300 calories a day. Um, that you're getting adequate protein is really important. So at least four servings of protein a day, equivalent to about 70 to 95 grams of protein. And about, so if you think of two eggs, that's about 10 grams of protein, or a piece of chicken breast, that's anywhere from 14 to 20 grams of protein, depending on how big the breast of chicken is. Um, there's some protein in nuts and seeds as well. There's some great charts online that a woman can access to find out how much protein's in the foods that she's consuming. Uh, the woman should also make sure that she's having enough calcium, so increasing calcium rich foods, which can be through dairy, but there's a lot of women that choose to avoid dairy or are sensitive to dairy. Mm -hmm. So sesame seeds is actually very, very high in calcium, and you can find that in raw sesame seeds, Tahini is just ground sesame seeds, or in hummus has tahini in it, so it has sesame seeds in it, as well as almonds and dark leafy green vegetables are good sources of calcium. You also want to make sure that you're having enough iron. Um, iron is obviously found in red meats, but is also found in an algae called spirulina that can be bought at health food stores. Mm -hmm. um, you can also find iron in dark leafy green vegetables and quinoa, actually. Mm -hmm. Also having enough fluids, um, fluids throughout pregnancy also help to decrease the chance of constipation which can be a common concern, but also um, sometimes women eat when they're actually thirsty. So making sure that you're having at least your six to eight glasses of fluids or water ideally a day. Um, and sometimes if you're feeling hungry, have, a, have some water and, and see how you feel. Um, also making sure that you're choosing complex carbohydrates. Right. So instead of the white rice, white bread, white pasta, having whole wheat, um, wheat bran, quinoa, brown rice, oats, barley, these are called complex carbohydrates and they take longer to digest in the body so don't de increase the spike in blood sugar as quickly and help to keep a healthy weight. Awesome. Well, hopefully you found this information helpful. Of course, uh, you know, if you have any weight gain concerns or nutritional concerns, obviously speak with your uh, family doctor, OB, midwife, and of course you can always come in and see a naturopathic doctor to make sure that you're eating the right type of foods and maintaining a healthy weight uh, gain during pregnancy. And we'd like to thank everybody for joining us for this series. Thank you.